Alright, this is how you build a fence by yourself. So we're building a four board horse fence that can contain horses. When you're building a fence by yourself, the first thing you want to do, it's a little trick that I learned. You set a holding screw in that post. Can you see that? So you want that screw to be off to the side and sticking out about an inch or so. That's going to hold your board as you set it on down the line. Next thing you want to do is measure. Now if you measure from outside of this post to the outside of this post, once you lay that board, it's going to be the same thing as center to center. You'll see what I'm talking about in a minute. So our measurement here is 191 and a quarter. So, the next thing that I do is mark the increment down the post that you're going to set your board. I'm going 14, 28, and 42. That's the, the height to the top of the second, third, and fourth board. This is the hardest part. You got to remember the measurement you took a minute ago. That was 191 and a quarter. So we mark off that 191 and a quarter. make that cut head on back to our track screw if you hold that board from the center it'll be nice and balanced set it on that end on the set screw now I like to push back on it as I work my way down to get to the end. I find that line that I marked for my height. Put your hip against it and hold it in place. One thing I forgot to mention. We're working with six inch boards so when you set that holding screw you want to set it about six inches from the line that you know the top of your board is going to be so that when you set it you'll get a nice even plane and sometimes you make it too high a little too low so you might have to take the screw out and adjust the height this one's pretty good I've been doing it all day put that second screw in pull out your holding screw Set your last two screws and you're done. One of the reasons I'm doing it this way is because I wanted to use screws rather than nails. I did some of it with a nail gun. It makes it quicker, but screws are better for horses. If they kick through a board, you can easily unscrew pop a new board on no problem those nails are a little hard to get out get the board out without ruining the integrity of your post I'm also staggering so this board runs from this post to this post this board runs from this post to this post that makes your fence stronger so you're not having a joint all the way down the line your joint is two out of four boards so helps strengthen uh, helps increase the integrity of your fence overall that's how you build a fence by yourself.